So let's proceed now for our sample problem number 3. So we have a uniformly distributed load of 200 pounds per foot is carried on a simple supported beam span. If the cross section is as shown, so kanin gipakita diri on the right side, determine the maximum length of the beam if the shearing stress is limited to 80 PS. I assume the loads acts over the entire length of the beam. So in yung notice is that uh, first, this problem is not in as a unit but in imperial or the English units. So na siya uniformly distributed load omega which is equal to 200 pounds per foot. Uh, next is, ang other given nato is that uh, this is a simply supported beam. Cross section is this one, kani ipakita. And then, uh, maximum daw nga shearing stress, so that is FB max is equal to 80 PSI. So, unsa may gi, uh, other condition is that the load na 200 pounds per foot, pound per foot is acting over the entire length of the beam. So, what we were asked, we were asked the total length of the beam. So, maximum length na pwede. Okay, so, unsa may buhat to na to ani if we have this one. So, uh, generally, ang uh, problem nga to ang ginasolve is, di ba, we, deter we, we need to determine the maximum uh, shearing stress. So, at a value, we need to get the shear force, and then the Q, and etc. So, kanisha is, this is, this one is also pabali. So, paatras ato ang koan, paagi ani. So, we have the maximum shearing stress, and then koan ato ang length. So, again, ang, af after we got the given, atong gisulat no, we have the omega nga 200 pounds per foot, and then maximum shearing stress nga 80 psi. Now, let's look at the given cross-section. So, if you notice the given cross-section, so, uh, ang cross-section is hollow. No? So, dili siya all throughout nga kuan. Di siya all throughout solid. Okay. But the neutral axis is same. Nagipon siya sa tunga. So, if you notice, naatay duha ka square or sorry, dua ka rectangle. Let's say, ato ning tagon nga rectangle 1, and then, kaning sa sulod, this is the rectangle 2. So, ang distance to the outermost fiber for the outermost nga rectangle, that is just half of the 10 inches, that is 5 inches. Now, para diri sa ikadua, diri sa sulod, this is equal to, since 8 inches mani high, so that is 4 inches. Next, ay maximum shearing stress na kuno. So, if you notice, ang shearing stress mag-act lang on this side, no? Diri sa duha. So, ato ang B diri is kaning duha. This one. So, pila mo siya. So, uh, we have a 6 inches diri. If this is uh, 6 inches, and then sa gawas, that is 8 inches. Sa to pa natay tag 1 inch, one inch dire sa kilid. So, atong additional nga given is that our B is equal to 2 inches. So, again, nga nung atong B is 2 inches lang, it is because the shearing stress at the mid uh, at the neutral axis acts only on this solid portion okay and uh, acts only on this fiber so wala may shearing stress diri okay, because this is hollow so that is atong b is 2 inches unsa pay uh, next na to pwede pa na to makuha actually we can get our i so di ba ato ang i is equal to 1 over 1 over 12 bh cube now, in this situation, this is hollow. So, ang pinakadali nga kung natog ay is that ang kaning outermost rectangle or rectangle 1 will be subtracted to the centroidal moment of inertia of the rectangle 2. So, that is equal to 1 over 12 times atong base 1 is 8 inches times height 1 is 10 inch cube. So, this is the rectangle 1 kaning kinadakan minus the rectangle 2. Okay, hollow naman ni siya. So, this is, uh, base na to is 6 inches, times height nga 8 inches cube. 
So our, our I is 1,232 over 3. And then don't forget for the units, the unit is inch to the fourth. Okay, and so by another uh, possible given, we have uh, a B, uh, also I, and then we have FB max. So we have FB is equal to VQ over IB. So ato na isa isa hon para maklaro na to unsay kulang niya. So we already have the Q, ah sorry, wala pa tayo Q. We already have the I, we already have the B, we have the uh, maximum shearing stress. Next na to makuha is the Q. So pila man si Q. So Q will just be equal to AY bar, di ba? So Q is equal to AY bar. And in this case, again, hollow ni siya. So, mura gipong siya, o ito gipong i-apply ani is same concept with the centroidal moment of inertia ang atong gibuhat. So, we'll have the area of the outermost rectangle minus the area of the second rectangle. Then, that will be our area. So, kanin siya nga Q will be this one. Kanin naman nga area to i-consider. Kanin siya. So, this will be our maximum area. So, this is ang kaning, kanisyang kinadakan minus kanisyang gamay. So, our area 1, so half sa ano, rectangle nga dako, that is, base times height, that is 8 inches, times height, which is equal to 5 inches, minus 6 inches, the area, half sa area sa gamay, times 4 inches. So, natay Q, which is equal to, 52 inch cube or 52 cubic inch so next day na to so we already have Q we have already have I and B and then our shearing stress next, unsa saan mo na to pagkuha ni B ni V so yung ni siya so yun niya simply supported so let's say this is our beam And then, na uh, uniformly distributed load. So, ito ang uniformly distributed load omega is equal to 200 pounds per foot. So, let's say this is our... So, on this side, on the left side, we have reaction 1. And then, on the right side, we have reaction 2. Let's say our length L is L. So, atong reaction 1 by symmetry, that is just equal to 200 times L over 2 or equal to 100 L. So, by symmetry, ang total force, gitungaan lang sa duha ka support. So, reaction 2, gaya po na to, is just equal to 100 L. So, in this uh, sample, ato ang VDI is equal to 100 L. So, diri din ato kwa on si maximum length. So, uh, substituting these values, so we have FB is equal to VQ over IB. So, since ang at, ano na to nakang V, let's solve for V. V is equal to FB IB over Q. So, we have 80 PSI, that is pounds per square inch times I din na to, that is 1,232 over 3 inch to the 4th times B na to, which is equal to 2 inches all over Q which is equal to 52 cubic inch from here natin masolve nga V is equal to yeah, so 80 times 1,232 times 2 divided by 3 divided by 52 that is 1,263.5897 pounds and since V is equal to 100L so 100L is equal to 1,263.5897 pounds 
So to solve for L, divide the, divide the 100, the both sides, the left and the right hand side. So then atong total length din nga ginapangita is equal to 12.636 feet. So this will be our answer for this particular problem. So again, if you notice, uh, this is a different approach. So delete siya pa forward. This is uh, pa atras. This is like a retroactive, no? So we're given a maximum shading stress, and then we were given also load. So moto we determine, and then ang gipangita is ang total length. So before ta ato substitute sa koan sa formula nga shading stress is equal to VQ over IB. So mas maayo nga ato determine ang each variables para igo na lang diretso na to i-input sa formula. So muna ito nga we determine the maximum sharing stress as 80 psi, the given load as 200 pounds per foot, and then ato ang uh, central moment of inertia is equal to kuan kaning uh, dako ang rectangle minus gamay nga rectangle. So ato siyang gi-minus it is because ang solid portion lang uh, solid portion naman ato ang i-consider for this uh, koan, for this problem. So, ang ga resist naman sa forces is the solid portion. So, ang ga resist sa shearing, uh, shearing force is the solid portion. Munang ang, muna nang subtract ta sa larger ng rectangle minus the gamay ng rectangle which is the hollow part. And then, ang ato ang Q is nag subtract ya punta no. This is the uh, the moment area of the larger half of the rectangle. So, this is the maximum ng Q minus the Q nga kaning halo and then we will obtain the Q or the mo first moment area of the remaining nga koan kani of the remaining area nga garisis yud sa shearing stress which is this one kani sa, sa sulod and afterwards ang ato ang B is just 2 inches ato ang nagikwa because at neutral axis only this side ang garisis sa shearing forces so that is 2 inches and then by koan by draw by koan pag draw na to sa beam we don't know the length but we know that the maximum shear is the reaction so we got the reaction from the given load na 200 pounds per foot so to ang reaction by symmetry is 100 l so from this uh, formula atong gi substitute ang tanan values here and then until we come out na to ang maximum length is 12.64 feet so this answers our problem